We are blessed here in central New York to be within a short driving distance to one of the happiest places on earth, ah. the Finger Lakes. And next weekend, over 90 different wineries from all over the region will be highlighted at the 2010 Finger Lakes Wine Festival. And along with all the tastings and the wine seminars available, the festival will also feature a series of culinary demonstrations to help you get the most from your New York State wine. Oh, yeah. And joining us now, I love her, but I don't like to stand next to her, <laughs> one of those special presenters and one of our favorite guests, Aww. Chef Julianne. Sagir, Julie Tabuli, we like to call yes. yeah. And you Hi. always look so fantastic. Well, I know. I'm a little, okay. little fashionista foodie girl. I, I know. Just be off camera. Just no, uh, we voiceover. should both be off camera and let Julie take it. But it's good to see you good again. To see you guys too. And what are we making today? Today we are uh, cooking it up, uh, Arabic cookout, Lebanese style Ooh, with love it. Uh, laham mishwi, which is basically lamb kebabs. Okay. Yeah, what so, is it called again? Laham mishwi. So okay. laham means lamb and mishwi means literally to grow. Laham means mm -hmm. lamb. Okay. Laham. Laham. Yeah. Laham. I've always called Laham. I've always called them shihi. <laughs> Okay, so we're yes. gonna start. You're gonna help me. Okay. I'm gonna help you make the lamb kebabs, right? right? Exactly. Yeah. So we're starting off. Basically, I took a leg of lamb, mm -hmm. and uh, we cubed this up. It's nice and fresh. So mm -hmm. I'm just gonna put this in this bowl here. We'll do a few, uh, few kebabs to get okay. us going here. Right. And we're gonna season. If you want to season that with this, some salt. Just a little bit. A little of salt. bit of salt. I mean, you can go a little, a uh, little bit more. You always want to make sure to. You guys really like it spicy, season. Julie, yeah. Okay. <laughs> season right. your meats really well, and some. Uh, You're known for ground I'm pepper, sorry. of course. Get that that going. Time. Now the laham mishwi, I mean traditionally, mm -hmm. our lamb kebabs, we basically just do the lamb okay. and onions. Okay. Um, and that's what we're going to do today. So okay. I'm going to keep it traditional in that style. We want to have time and to talk about the big wine festival. So yes. why not, I should start just... Yeah, just uh, start interchanging the okay. lamb meat and the... It's uh, pronounced uh, laham. On <laughs> <laughs> laham, to and be and correct. Onions. Okay. Yes. And, and this is what you're going to be demonstrating down at the wine festival or um, no? I'm going to be doing another lamb uh, kebab called kifta, actually, at the wine festival. Okay. Uh, okay. Along with some other of my signature specialties like Great. tabbouleh and falafel, of course, because I'm like, what's a festival? Without, without falafel, falafel. Oh, yeah. I got to bring you. falafel on that. I'm with you. Um, and I'll be doing a demonstration on Sunday, July 18th at 3.30 p.m. Um, and that's going to be indoors at their media center there. So it holds okay. about 40 to 50 people, they're telling me. Great. Um, so the this thing is at Watkins Glen, Julie? This is at Watkins Glen okay. Finger Lake Wine Festival. Okay. And um, You're working with Hazlitt Winery as I well, am. Right? I'm, work I'm really excited. I'm partnering up with Hazlitt Winery. And uh, basically, I'm going to be pairing my dishes with their wonderful wines and wow. today I'm pairing my laham with laham. their uh, laham. Cabernet Franc <laughs> so Ooh. I think Love that it. yeah that should be a really nice choice for this and actually a lot of their wines just have really nice um, you know they just go really well with a lot of our spicier mm -hmm. like the falafel and the kifta right. they all have a little right. bit of spice to them so and this is new I have may have been to the Finger Lakes wineries uh, and the wine fest a go. couple of times and right. so the food pairings is kind of something that's new that they're trying I think um, I think I believe they did it last year I know you know but but, um, but you may be right on that. Yeah, they're there's, starting it. They're more starting more. it exactly more and more, and um, they have them going on all day Saturday, of course, all day Sunday, outdoors, indoors. So if people want to come, I know they fill up fast. So if you want to come, join me. I would love to have you, and uh, definitely um, try to get on getting quickly. I okay. guess. Cool. So all right. So yes. what do we got? Should all I right. put these on so, here? So yeah, we're gonna obviously you could do these outside, but right. we're gonna do these on a cast iron skillet and let ooh, let's sizzle. Let's just put those down on there. Nice. And turned out pretty good, don't you think? Thank you. Wow, you Thank got you two done, and I only got one. I know, I know. you were talking. <laughs> I see so. you're using wooden skewers. Should we soak those in water first? Yeah, Julie, you or? should. Yeah, when you're using wooden, you want to just make sure they're in water just so they don't, you know, cause a cause a commotion with fire going okay. on and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then um, basically we're going to grill these for about four to five minutes on each side. Usually lamb mm -hmm. is about, you want the temperature to be about 160. That's like a medium. Okay. Is yeah. lamb tougher to cook than say beef or should people just kind of do it the same way? It's really the same, in a sense the same way. I mean you can, um, it's fresh, you know, fresh beef, fresh lamb. It usually has around the same cooking temperatures. You know, okay. if you want it a little bit more rare, you can go about 145 on the cooking temperature and uh, well done is about 
about like 170 or so. Beautiful. So, okay, well, great. And um, what unfortunately, we we're it? running yeah. out of time, but okay. give us the whole finished product. Okay, so this the is the Laham platter. Um, basically, we've got our Arabic rice, uh -huh. uh, and we've got a caramelization. I've done uh, baby sweet peppers, mushrooms, onions, a whole bunch of fresh herbs, wow. and of course, we have our tum, which is always you served use that with, with everything. everything. That's your signature That's sauce, that. right? Yeah, you can't have laham without tum. So, oh, wow. well, Julian, yes. we'll see you down at the Finger Lakes yes, Wine Festival. Yes, I'm looking forward to it. Always a pleasure. Thank you. I'm going to so wear much. something sexier the next time she comes in. I decided. I <laughs> I'm just going like to okay. stay, yeah. no. stay off camera. The Watkins Glen Finger Lake Wine Festival is running Friday, July 16th through Sunday, July 18th. If you'd like tickets and information, contact the Watkins Glen Ticket Office, 1-866-461-7223, or visit flwinefest.com. And don't forget to catch Julie on stage at the Fest 3.30, Sunday, July 18th, during her Meet Me in the Mediterranean oh Lebanese Cuisine demonstration. Can't wait to see what she's wearing there. <laughs> Check out WCNY Connected with us, Ted and Amy. Thursday nights at 9 on WCNY.